All right, I know you've written an article for the Orange and Brown Report. Um, how does the Browns' 2023 roster compare to the 2020, 2021, and 2022 rosters? Again, you can check this out at the Orange and Brown Report. I'd also encourage you to follow Jack on Twitter. Those of you who watch the show know we use his stuff quite a bit. So tell, take us through that article where you're comparing rosters. Yeah, so um, just sort of looking at position rooms, what's up, what's down, and what's sort of unusual. Um, the two downs that we'd normally see is running back and O-line. I'd have expected if um, Alex Wright would go to IR and bring back Michael Dunn onto the roster, the O-line would be where we'd expect it to be. So that's one that is unusual to what we'd see. We'd usually see one more on the O-line, one less on the D-line. And so that's something to keep in mind that a change from what we've seen in the past. And then the other change is we're one down at running back. There's always been four running backs in the team, and that's not including Felton. I've always counted him as wide receiver because that's where he's always played before this preseason. And we're one DB up. We've got 11 DBs on the roster, which is quite unusual to be that high. Um, so that's just two position rooms to keep in mind that they might still be out there looking for people. In terms of running backs, it could be Lennon Fournette that they go out because you've got eight career carries for Ford. You've got 10 career carries for Strong. That's it behind Nick Chubb. So that could be something where they go, actually, let's drop one of the DBs and we'll sign Leonard Fournette. And then at O-line, Dennis Kelly um, was let go by the Eagles. He's a veteran swing tackle. They could look to bring him in and then maybe cut down on one of the defensive linemen. So just two positions to keep in mind that they're up in and they're, they're down in. Nothing wrong with that. It's all about finding the best players and then that you'll balance that out with the inactive list. 